Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. Today I'm going to do a video on making some awesome holiday ornaments with alcohol inks. So these are the plastic ball ornaments that you can get from pretty much anywhere. I got them from Michael's, a whole huge pack of them for pretty inexpensive. And I'm using a variety of alcohol inks, mainly Ranger and Pinata but I have a few Pixis inks as well. I did not do anything to prep the ornament. I just basically went right in there with the alcohol ink. So for this one, I used green, red, white, and gold, and I think it came out gorgeous. And you can probably notice that I am holding these on something. These are just silicone funnels. You can use any kind of funnel really, but it just made it a little bit easier to hold onto it and then also to have something that I could just set it up to dry on without having to worry about that. They, drew, they do dry very, very quickly though. So if you don't have any funnels or anything else to set it on, you can literally just hold on to it for a minute and it'll dry. You can also have a hair dryer nearby, but just be careful. You don't want to use any kind of heat source to dry it quickly because that can warp and melt the plastic balls. This can be done on glass ornaments as well, and it would work even a little bit better. You can do this on the disc ornaments, flat ornaments, etc. So in this color combination, I'm doing blue, silver, and white. You could, of course, use any and all colors that you would like. Um, on this one particularly, I actually tried spraying the ball ahead of time with a little bit of isopropyl alcohol, and that made it more transparent and made the ink spread out a little bit more. So that can just be a little something else that you can do to uh, modify your design. Another thing you can do is after you have put your alcohol inks on there, you can give it a very light spritz with alcohol, and that can uh, just give you a little bit of a different pattern. One other note on here, you can probably tell I have some silicone molds underneath, and that is because I don't like to waste at all if possible. So I'm actually catching those alcohol ink drips and then I put a little more alcohol ink in the coasters once I was done and poured some resin in there and made a beautiful set of coasters. So let these dry and then just put some ribbon or string in on the top and that's really all there is to it. You can seal them if you want but you don't need to. I didn't seal these. This one I actually put glitter in the inside as well. <laughs> Um, if you want to seal it, use something like a Krylon Kamar spray, which can hold on to that ink and not make it run. So there you go. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.